Project Attica is a proactive response to the crisis of mass incarceration. It's a way to engage, empower, and support groups that are advocating for change through the arts. Our main focus is exclusively to use art as a way to empower people and show them how they can use art as a vehicle to drive conversation and to support and break barriers amongst each other. We chose Mexico and Chiapas specifically because we wanted to be able to connect with the roots of artivism. What I mean by roots is that I was taught about a concept from a Zapatista sister back when I was in law school before starting Project Attica. Gracias por estar acá en este taller. Se llama el taller de activismo para que unidos podamos alzar nuestras voces. The most valuable experience was really connecting with the kids and with the people on a very, very basic and grounded level. Uh, what I mean by that is that our, the main workshop that we were able to offer happened in the town square and actually it was really organic because we were put in contact with some community youth leaders who are actually dancing in the town square and that was part of their routine was to go meet in the town square and then perform and they would do this all outfitted in the traditional Aztec and Mayan actually attire and the drums were there so they came by other youth leaders came by and we started to do the workshop we talked about what artivism was and then the kids started to come by so kids would come and these are the same kids who are selling you bubble gum or food and they work all day, so they didn't think that they could come and make a workshop or even join one and make a shirt for free. So that was really nice and special. It was beautiful because they would actually help each other. One would put down the materials that just minutes ago they were selling to tourists and do a t-shirt that they were able to keep while the other one would wait for them and then they would also get the turn. So in the end, it was really beautiful because it was really primarily about giving back the gift to the kids and we did it and we're really, really appreciative of everybody who supported our efforts to go to Mexico with Chaplin.